The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When evildoers came against me to devour my flesh, my foes and my enemies stumbled and fell. Though an army deploy against me, my heart is not afraid. Though war break out against me, still I am confident. I have asked one thing from the Lord. It is what I desire, to dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life. Gazing on the beauty of the Lord and seeking him in his temple. For he will conceal me in his shelter in the day of adversity. He will hide me under the cover of his tent. He will set me high on a rock. Then my head will be high above my enemies around me. I will offer sacrifices in his tent with shouts of joy. I will sing and make music to the Lord. Lord, hear my voice when I call. Be gracious to me and answer me. In your behalf, my heart says, seek my face. Lord, I will seek your face. Do not hide your face from me. Do not turn your servant away in anger. You have been my help. Do not leave me or abandon me, God of my salvation. Even if my father and mother abandon me, the Lord cares for me. Because of my adversaries, show me your way, Lord, and lead me on a level path. Do not give me over to the will of my foes, for false witnesses rise up against me, breathing violence. I am certain that I will see the Lord's goodness in the land of the living. Wait for the Lord. Be courageous and let your heart be strong. Wait for the Lord. Let's pray. Father, thank you that we can have confidence in you. Thank you that you are gracious to hear and answer our prayers. Thank you that in your love you protect, you defend and you provide for your people. You are our light and our salvation. I pray that you would give each of us, David's heart, a desire as he wrote to dwell in your presence to spend our time gazing on your beauty and majesty. In times of difficulty or adversity or pain or loneliness, I pray that you will give shelter, that you will be our shelter, that you will give safety and security, that you will give us confidence in you, confidence to face whatever the world throws at us, knowing that you are always with us, always with all your people. I pray that you would strengthen our faith in you. I pray that you would strengthen our assurance of your love and our courage to live as your children in this world. When we see all around us people threatening your church, when we see all around us people oppressing your church, when we see all around us people challenging your truth, pray that you would strengthen us to live for you. Give us peace to wait for you, to wait on you and to wait in you through everything that we face today and every day. In Jesus' name, Amen.